they provide us with information that this was the first first time that they are treated like one like human beings The buses that are bringing refugees to this border crossing in Berkasovo are uh, coming uh, throughout the day and also throughout the night. And we see many parents, many mothers uh, with children uh, who are uh, cold when it's raining. And of course, during the night, all of them are very cold. And uh, they are uh, also sometimes crying. Kids are, of course, they, they have just spent six or seven hours in the bus and now they are out in the cold and uh, not really knowing what's ha going to happen next. For us at Switzerland's leading child relief agency, December the 18th is a day to remember that half the world's migrants are children. Some of them are forced to leave home with their parents because of armed conflicts or natural disasters. Others migrate completely alone because they need to contribute to their family's economic survival. When children migrate, they're exposed to all sorts of dangers. They're exploited in ways that are hard for us even to imagine ways that we cannot accept. At Terre des Hommes, we're committed to protecting children. Children have a right to a safe place to sleep, to food and clothing, and to psychological and emotional support. In situations like this, when kids see these little tables, the toys, the light also and these little chairs for kids and all these all these contents that we are offering to them uh, of course they are very much attracted to, to it they come by themselves sit by the table start drawing and playing to me it seems as they are hungry uh, for, for toys and for opportunities to play international migrants day is also an opportunity for us to say thank you to our donors your support is vital and we are committed to ensuring that the money you give makes the biggest possible positive impact on the lives of vulnerable children.